I got into yoga actually after basic training in 2002. I joined the army in 2002 and then when I went to what's called advanced individual training or the Armed Forces School of Music, I saw an advertisement for yoga classes at the local gym and I thought I would check it out and it was a Hatha yoga class and I was instantly hooked after that class. I'm studying yoga, tai chi, and music. I came here with the intention of um, starting a student group for partner dancing or ballroom dancing and social dancing. I have the goal of being a dance instructor uh, and incorporating tai chi and yoga into my teaching because uh, I think they go along very well. Specifically, tai chi has helped my social dancing immensely. I've had some of my dance partners say how much I'm easier to follow. They enjoy dancing with me more. And that was just since taking Tai Chi. And I've only done Tai Chi this school year. So that has helped out a lot there. And it's helped me to be more grounded in just going through different personal issues that I may be going through. I'm able to stay with them more and not try to avoid any issues and really work through it in a relaxed way, so that's helped a lot. And in the Writing One class, we have been writing a lot of narratives and personal creative reflection pieces that deal with our own story in one way or another, whether it's about an experience we had in life or it's writing in a specific um, literary style. So we have workshops with each of the um, assignments that we turn in each week. That involves a small group or the whole class and we share each other's writing that we did for the week and then we have get input from our peers as well as we'll go over the readings each week in class and discuss them. We each get the chance to share what we think about it, whether we like it or not or whether it works for us. So it's very much more, it's much more interactive. It's an experience you won't really get anywhere else. And you'll have the best support that you could possibly have from teachers, from faculty, from students, from the academic support, from um, you know, a random neuropa person you may see. Everyone's very much approachable. And so you'll, you can have that safety net, that support to work through whatever it is you may be working through. It's been a good experience, and as well as on campus. Um, anywhere, just you know, walk by and say hi and stop and chat with pretty much anybody. Well, I'd say first off, definitely go to Naropa because it's an experience you won't really get anywhere else. Because I can be quite self critical, as I'm sure a lot of us can be. And, well, especially with Tai Chi, I've been able to relax with whatever is happening and stay with it, don't back off or don't just fly off the handle, but to let the experience be that experience and then observe what's happening. It was kind of a observer's perspective rather than being caught up in whatever situation is happening. And then, uh, so that's helped me as, as just, just to be more peaceful with myself.